Greetings everyone, here is Ludwig and this is a game War in the Pacific Admirals Edition and this is my play by email match against Jochen, he is the commander of the Allied Forces, for me the Empire of Japan. Today we will check the 16th March 1942. This is the day after my Chinese forces break the stalemate in central of China and uh, we will soon see the reaction of Jochen if he counterattack, hold the line or fall back. Uh, yeah, Maybe I will also try to take a Palm Bang and a Darwin this turn. Suva maybe need one or two more turns to wait to the arrival of my Japanese uh, reinforcements. Uh, yeah. The Navy Guard units are too weak to overcome the New Zealand brigade there. But uh, Suba will also soon under Japanese uh, control. And the rest, uh, hard to say, my submarines trying to uh, find uh, Jochen his carrier fleet, but maybe it's already too late. And I sent my own carrier fleet to the Indian Ocean to find and finish Hermes. Because up to now I hear no sinking sound, so I guess uh, I need to make sure that Hermes is not returning to port and fight another day. Yeah, and one of my robots can intercept here one AP on the way to Port Mosby or coming back, how to say. After many days of no success, at least something. And we hear a sinking sound. Good. Now the American submarine is trying to attack a minesweeper. Okay, even if he had success, it would not really bother me. But no, no attack. Oh, no success. The same here, source of Davao. Okay. So there's still American and submarine or Dutch submarines operating here. This is a British uh, heavy cruiser, but. Oh, this is normally American uh, heavy cruiser, but under yeah, British command. And I launched six torpedoes and not one hit. This is normally what I was hoping for. Uh, not a good day, but uh, yeah, it's like it is. Here are B, this is Source New Zealand, and I try to uh, find still Jochen's convoy lines, how he moves his uh, stuff. And this is my carrier fleet uh, east of Australia. My, I get only information that there is something on long whole island. And I try to find it. Or I, no hit here, only port strikes. So there's this ship, at least one ship, my scouts told me, but uh, yeah, my strike was not successful. So I can see here some dots that Jochen is, looks like pulling out of uh, Changsha and also maybe out of uh, the southern city. So I bomb here first because this city uh, is a uh, more important to get this highway open, so maximum effort here. Mm, damage is so so for the amount of aircraft I throw. On. But at least if it's true that Jorgen is moving out, so the problem is on the map you only see that at least one unit is moving. You never know if whole units or how many units are moving. And there's only the indication that something is moving, but you don't know which speed and how many units is. So the information can mislead sometimes. Good. More strikes here. Damage is uh, not game changing. Some D 
daylight bombardment and I have really nothing to stop this. So two more zero kills on the ground for Jochen. But these are all only airframes. All the pilots are already um, out of this squadron, so in worst case I'm losing 20 more zero airframes. I try to repair them, but uh, if Jochen attack me, then I can never really get anything out there. But there's not much I can do. to attack the Dutch short. Maybe I could do this long time ago. I simply forgot about this option. I was a little worried if I attack the ground forces that I maybe damage the industry, but I never really try it and it looks like uh, the chance to make damage to the industry is very small. So I not soften up all these Dutch forces. So no surprise at the airstrikes, mm. missing a single AP, a small AP, but looks it was an empty one. Oh, yeah. And the missing uh, failed attack on this heavy cruiser, this is a big, uh, uh, this is a big blunder of this uh, turn. So far. Okay, attack on Palm Bank. Maybe this time Fort Zero and I take Palm Bank. Fine. Hello, you fighting orcas of the Pacific. This is your favorite enemy, Morgan Anne, at Radio Tokyo. With music to lift your spirits and words to depress your morale. But first, Imperial General Headquarters announced today that. The ever-victorious forces of the Japanese Empire have captured Palembang. So, good news out of Tokyo. The sweet uh, voice of Tokyo Rose always uh, mm, let my heart uh, run faster. So, the Dutch forces are nowhere to see more. So, all now in prison camp, making labor work and try to mm, repay the damage they did uh, against the Empire and the poor people of uh, Sumatra. So light losses only for me. So uh, finally the, fi the end battle was a uh, complete success. Uh, now the question will be only, this is much more important, is how much industry damage the Dutch uh, could do before they uh, uh, give up the fight. At the same time here in Mindanao, maybe the last resistance of the American forces, not much resistance, so they give up easily, but they still don't want surrender. Uh, yeah, 30 more disabled units for me, but only disabled, and uh, you can see the high numbers of destroyed of American so What is running away is now only guns, engineers, and maybe some vehicles, and some support guys, but it uh, looks like all the army guys already gave up. 
Battle of Darwin, fought again zero, and I take Darwin. So every land battle is successful today. A very good day for the Japanese army. But here are the Australian forces are all retreating also. So no surrender. But light losses only for me and heavy casualties for the Australians so I must try to catch them and uh, yeah, uh, finish them off before they can rebuild their forces. But overall uh, maybe not successful day uh, at the sea but uh, very successful for all the land battles. What is missing is uh, Suva and yeah, then I can have a better feeling about the situations. Or more safe feeling. So, first intelligence report uh, again in the air. Not much happened. I lost uh, three zeros uh, on the ground. This is a uh, airstrike on Port Blair, and the rest are all operational losses in China. Okay, and out of the seven airframes gets killed, I lost one pilot. So, pilot loss is very small. Uh, in the airframes I can all produce. Uh, and because of the high kill ratio or losses on for the allies, not I think the Dutch forces are also... I don't know more if they, I think Dutch forces are counting like Chinese forces or like Japanese. I think you don't get so many points for the Dutch at least. So now it's like uh, 77 to 6. It's it's a good kill ratio, better than 10 to 1 at least, and uh, fine. Uh, ships sunk. Today, one small Dutch AP, but looks like empty so but at least it's the AP and this also this was in Darwin so there was a ship under construction a, a minesweeper but uh, now because I take the port it's uh, broken good uh, five points more for me well less for Jochen mm. Yeah, not much here to say. So in China we had no battle, only I think bombardment and air, a lot of air bombardments and airstrikes. I already arrived with my tank forces, uh, uh, f were not completely 400 attack value, but they're all in a mm, good shape. So all of the tanks forces are ready to fight. So I try to crash this. This is only one unit, so there's no backup force. Jochen don't have a deep defense system. Let's say this. So if I can crash here, then maybe I can immediately drive uh, uh, behind the lines. I also see here a small dot is moving east. So maybe Jochen try to take this hex and... Uh, cut off the, my supply lines. I'm not so sure. So maybe this is not a uh, real moving Maybe he only moved one unit to lure me out and maybe he also don't move this way out Maybe he moving with all his forces to the east. I Will know this first next turn um, I have no other choice. I will focus all well, most of my Forces to the source. I must take this base if I have this base then I secure all my supply lines this hex is simply not possible to defend. Good. So, next turn we will know more. No activity in Burma or Thailand. Uh, bombardment of Port Blair. So, again, I have no supplies left. Because the daily bombardment will always... What I bring in, to, in on supplies, uh, Jochen will burn with his airstrike. So, not much I can do. There was a British formation somewhere here, but now I have no detection mode. So I know there's some carrier, uh, a carrier or cruisers at least in this water still. But uh, if I don't uh, can get a torpedo hit and slow them down, it's too risky to attack them. So I will move with my carrier still west, west, 
and then northwest to find uh, Hermes. I was first uh, hoping that maybe more is coming here, but it looks like nothing, so I will now send my uh, submarines to find Hermes, and maybe this also will work. I was first a little scared because I was sure that Jochen will have here maybe his carriers and anti-submarine duty or something like this, but uh, so far no one attacked my submarines, so maybe Jochen is not coming. Maybe he let uh, Hermes run alone. I don't know. We will see. So now the big moment, palm bank situation. I take the base. Nothing here is destroyed. The most important is very small damage. Out of 1,020 refineries, only 20 are damaged. Only 18 oil wheels are damaged, so very minor damage. And the resources are completely fine. And manpower is always one to one, at least to 99%. It's always, but manpower is what you don't need at the Japanese. You have enough. So, not only that the Dutch give up, I also take the industry completely intact. So now my industry base is secured. Whatever happens now, I have enough fuel for 42, 43, and maybe even for 44. It depends on mm, how well I can defend my oil in Miri, Tarakan. Not Tarakan is maybe not so important, but Miri, Balipapan, Palmbeng, these three locations are the, the center stone of all fuel production for the Japanese. Of course, you have also Tarakan, Brunei, and here some other additional oil wheels, and also here in the there is everywhere a little oil you can uh, get. And I would say the disaster of uh, Soabaya cost me a quarter million supplies. But it was really only Soabaya was a total disaster. Bataria was just so, so barely 50-50, but also not too much industry here. And most important is that Tarakan, Balipapan, all the oil, Miri, normally Miri is always starting with 50% damage, uh, like Brunei, but this is no additional damage, let's say this. So, this is okay. I have now the, the possibility to run my industry into 43, 44. Now it's on me how I handle the logistics in the repair of the damaged equipment. But uh, like I would say, if you take Palm Bank and Palm Bank is damaged more than 50%, it's impossible to repair it. You don't have the supplies and you don't have the time. We, simply because the game limited you to one facility repair per day. So if you have your 500 destroyed oil, you need 500 days to repair it. That is simply too slow. And you cannot uh, repair 500 oil with 500,000 supplies, uh, where you get the supplies. I have barely enough to feed all my war effort in China. Maybe if you don't fight in China, you have maybe supplies to repair, but you can only choose repair or fight in China. Good. So, the next successful strike was here in, uh, in, in the Philippines. Uh, I took here the base. Uh, ah no, here I fight and I win, but one unit still is in this hex. So uh, sometimes this happened. I don't know exactly why, but the rear guard and they cost me one turn. So I cannot move now to this hex because there's still one American force is blocking me. Uh, this guy maybe, yeah. Uh, hold the line to give the other units more time to retreat. The question is where they want to retreat. This is the last base the Americans have. Good. Uh, and now in Darwin. Oh yeah, Darwin was still. There was also a battle. This turn had really too many battles. So I also take Darwin. Not that Darwin is... Oh. Uh... Darwin, the base itself is, looks like undamaged, and on top I get also 20 resources, not that this is important, but I get here some intact base. Most important is the air base is intact, the port is intact, 
So now I can move my air base inside the hex and unload and maybe in two days I have already air equipment and aviation support to run my air force out of Darwin and help me to slow down this Australian forces. The main effort, uh, I must normally get rid of this. I won't hunt them down. I must kill them all. Or at least I must damage them that there's really no walk, only empty shells or something like this. I would normally prefer to really kill them so that Jochen must buy them back. This costs him also, I think, three months, roughly, I think. Every land force you can buy back. It's not, not so expensive to buy them back. But I think there's a time of three months or something like this that uh, before you get them really back. So more delay time before he get reinforcements. Plus he must fill up all these empty units. And it's getting also additional points for me. Now these units are all disabled. So if I now can catch them, they're all dying. More points for me. Why not? Uh, but I have not unlimited time. So I will go here down maybe this way maximum and then uh, if I cannot catch them after this it's too late I don't want to go too deep to the desert yeah and uh, nothing else happened here uh, I still waiting attack Suva maybe next turn I still have the simple that there's a, a ship in the port but I my airstrike was not successful so I will try it next time again and hopefully I find the ship whatever is here Always try to escape and then I can sink it maybe with Navy Strike. But I'm f I cannot come too close to Sydney and I must make sure that Jochen don't try to lure my um, Navy Bombers in a cap trap. Not that he make long range cap over a air fo a air, um, um, Navy task force. So I don't want to lose here something because I'm very sure that there are many fighters waiting in Sydney. So, but I let them wait in Sydney. I don't must go to Sydney. I want only kill Caros on the sea. Good. Maybe the really last moment was here in my submarine. Find one enemy AP. But I lost contact with the task force. But they will run very likely between Cooktown and Port Moresby or Townsville, Port Moresby. Here are some supply lines. Goody. Thank you all. Next time we see how... Uh, yeah, next time we will see if I can take Suva. So, Suva is still missing. Uh, but most other battles are now done. Of course, I still normally need a solution for Burma. So, but maybe I will prepare something to take Burma in a surprise way. Thank you all. Take care. Bye bye.